Oh, I thought it was his head. I thought it was too. Oh my goodness. Did you get him? Did you get him? Yeah. yeah. Johan got him. Let's see that. Woo! Look at this monster. It's a monster. Look at that. That's a big one. Oh my goodness. Look at that shot. Oh my goodness. Jeez, dude. Good job, Johan. Yeah. Good shooting, my guy. There we go. Ooh, another one in the bag. That's what iguana people do. Oh, yeah. Oh, they can belly shot. Oh, 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 oh. Wow, look at the blood on this puck. Oh. Um, good job. Right here, gentlemen. Good job. Oh, there's another one. Look right there. See him right there? Oh, yeah, I get him. You ready? Okay. Yeah, I'm ready. Ooh. No, we're on the page contract now. Oh, yeah, how, how long that contract last? Two years? Five years now. Five years, oh. Yep. So young people walk their dogs here. Okay, well, we're not, we're not bothering okay. any dogs here. Excuse me. I'll see what, if I'm on YouTube. Okay. So, okay. That's fine. You have no right. Shut you're that. In, Shut you're that in, up. You're interfering with, with, Show with. No, no, no. We're not, you're interfering. What's that? Show us the contract. We don't have to, you man. You don't have to. No, you don't no, we don't well, have why to. Why do you have to come over here and interrupt? Because we feed the animals. We're not bothering you. We're not bothering you. We're not, bothering we're not, bothering you. We're not gonna come over when you're shooting over animals. here. We're not, we're not okay, bothering you. Well, when you're here, then we can yeah, you give you your leave. space. No, we don't. No, we don't. You you're interfering. You're interfering. Yeah, we're not. We call security. We call security on you, but they'll make it solve the problem. Please do. You want us to? Call them up right now. Yep, ma'am. So we, we have a contract here to do iguana removal, yeah. and that's what we're doing. Well, that's your opinion. It's a fact that we have a contract. Yeah. I see you on so, YouTube making money. Yeah. Yeah. We're, we're out here doing removal. Are you going to pay the bill? You don't. Are you going to pay the bill? I'm just going to pay the cash. Well, okay, okay that's fine. That. And, and we, we don't have no problem with that. And I appreciate if you wouldn't be firing when we're here. We're not firing. We're not firing. You so, walked so, in on yeah. us. Yeah. We, not, you you walked in on us. You walked in on us. So and you did some asking. respect, lady. I didn't know. Dig you. some respect or pay the bill. Yeah. Dig some respect. There you go. You guys can leave now. No, Bye. I live here. You don't live here. Where's your house? I'm not going to say. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. We don't shoot anywhere Bye, Karen. Over there. Exactly. We don't, we don't shoot anywhere. We're, we're doing our job here, man. Uh, you walked in on us, so you can do whatever. And then we'll do what we're doing. Okay, I appreciate it. You go over there while we do it. Okay. okay. We're, not, we're not bothering you. Like, no yeah. more on us. Yeah, exactly. No more on us. What do you have to say? Exactly. Well, as you can see, but, you know, this is what it is. It is what it is. They can't help themselves. They don't understand the rules and regulations of invasive species. But, you know, that's what's happening. So, chalk it up to another Karen. And this is what yeah, we got. At the end of the day, we got a job to do. We got a contract. We have authority to be out here. It's encouraged by the state of Florida. People have their opinions. That's fine, but they have no right to interfere with what we're doing. We didn't. We're minding our business. They should do the same. Right. That's period. Animals, don't kill them. No, there. Killers, killers, killers. We can go in circles. I'll walk circles around you. Did you know that? When's the last time you saw a native duck? Never. These invasives are being invasive. I have not seen a native duck in a long time. Interruption with, uh, you know, uh, removing, removing the invasive species. If they actually looked up the rules, they can be in some serious trouble. There's a statue on that. There's a statue. Uh, mess with hunters and people doing pest control. Right. And that's the problem. And, and they don't understand it. You know, and it's not like we're trying to be mean. What are you doing? They walked up on us. We didn't, we didn't walk up on them. They deliberately came in, ran right up, yeah. and they're actually doing illegal things by feeding invasive species. No, we We've had this problem before with with the same individuals, but yeah. Yeah. this is this is the result of it. Like so we do have a contract to be out here. That's why we're doing it, and we're, we're taking them out before they start breeding and repopulating like crazy. Facts. They, I, we should have told her about the bridge right here and what's going on with the bridge. Exactly. exactly. They have these people are just so oblivious and so such in La La Land about feeding the ducks we don't have a problem with that that's what they want to do cool but at the end of the day we have a contract we got a job we got to do that's it and we're not going to let no people 
interfere with us. No That's more. Right. No Not more. at all. This bridge isn't in Not at all. Of the, the iguana people, of the the iguana people are doing the job. Exactly. Yeah. And that's all we're doing. We're not out here, out here hunting ducks. We're not out shooting here. Shooting pigeons out the sky. Shooting pigeons out of the sky. We're out here taking care of invasive species. Only. And, and that's it. If they have a problem with it, they can contact the FWC and they will educate them. <laughs> Probably give them a fine. Probably too. give them a fine. But they don't get it. Okay, here's the thing. You don't have authority to even be seeing that. You're just a resident out here. No, no, I, I already called the college. Okay, and what they say? I couldn't even get anybody that knew anything about it. Okay, how about this? Next time we're out here, we'll have the contract with us so we can show you. Yeah, I'd like and it. And that's, that's not a problem. We're not out here, trust me. We're not out here just because we want to be out here like that. I appreciate it. And also, check this out. You guys, Are you guys aware of the iguana situation here yeah, in Florida? I don't, like, like, I don't want to hear you. I'm just asking. Have you guys been reading the news? Have you guys, do you guys I keep up with FWC? The state of Florida is from Orlando down to here. Do you think you're really going to kill every single iguana? We're controlling, in your we're, con we're controlling them. No, we don't. We're, we're controlling the populations out here. Iguanas are at a record high right here in Florida, especially since there's no cold fronts. Right, can I just ask you something? Yes, ma'am. There's people playing golf over here. We're not shooting anywhere no, no, no. over there. There's Okay. You were shooting at night, and I thought maybe you were going to continue doing that. This is broad daylight. This is a nice area that children come, they ride their bikes over here. Okay. If we're here. all of you shooting in broad daylight. We're here on a Sunday. The police are aware that we're here, and it's something that needs to be done. We're just controlling the iguanas. We're not saying that we're going to kill all of them, but right now is the breeding season. So we're trying to prevent any of them from breeding even more, whatever we can. Have you guys... You guys come out here for sport to do it? That I know you have a business that you go to people's houses. I have a pest control business. Okay, then okay. why don't how you many people that? does it Guess take... Guess what we're doing right now. This is pest control. Okay, but, but how many people does it take to try out your new toy gun? What you that's, Brent, there's, that's not a toy, man. That's, that's, not, yeah, that's not nothing a toy. we nobody's, have is a toy. Nobody's trying anything. I'm using my stuff. Real quick, though, have you guys seen the, the, the damage over here on the side of the bridge? Oh, yeah. Do you know why this bridge can't be used anymore? Yeah, because we lived there a long time before. That's not what I asked. I said, do you know why yes. the bridge cannot be moved? Yes. The iguanas? No, no. Why? No. Why? Because the people who live in this neighborhood laid down on this bridge. They didn't want the street to go through. This area. So we've been here a lot longer than that. Have you seen the side of the. Have okay. you seen the side? Have you seen. Did you see the hole in there? There's a yeah, giant. Who uses this screw but you guys? We don't even cross this. Okay. You can't cross it. It's, it's This is private I'm property. I'm not walking on it. You're you can't, you're, you can't even walk on it. It's really. I'm it's a hazard. Call security because I want to see if they know you're here. They, they of do. Course they know. You, you can't just be. Oh, this is. A, oh, this yeah. is a very. We okay. have a contract. Oh. We're not just here. We can't so, just come so, here. I believe that contract's over with. It's no. not. Do you know we can have a contract up to like, six you know, years? Friday, we'll Google and look up some more information. Those guys that were here with you. Why should we go on Google? And you because okay, you, look, you refuse to listen to us. Listen, we're trying to teach. Okay. You. Guys, I would just advise you guys to educate yourself on what's going on with iguanas in Florida. I see. That's about it. No, we don't. Okay, listen, if we love to kill animals, you see all these ducks, they would have been gone. They would have yeah, gone. You see those ducks right there? They would have been gone, man. Yeah, We're only here for the invasive them. iguanas. We're here for iguanas. That's it. All right. You guys have a lovely day. How many iguanas? We're fine. We eat them. Invasive we eat iguanas? the iguanas. Invasive iguanas? We take them there? out and we eat them. So what are you going to tell me about that? About about my heritage, that's, about what that's, we do. That's information you do not need to know, ma'am. I'm not asking you how much you make. How much do you make? How much exactly. do you make? Exactly. Exactly. You guys have a lovely day. Thank you for visiting the Iguana Man, Iguana Ninja. We love you guys. I hope you guys go on Google and find out more information. Go on FWC. Help yourself to more information. I would like for you to call the college security over here. You want me to go ring the bell for the You can do whatever you need to do, ma'am, to make you happy. We are on a job. You have a pleasant day. Mad yep. love and respect towards you. Please get home safe. Please go on FWC. Please go on Florida.com, whatever you need to know. All right, all right, all right. Hang out here for, okay, let them hang out. Okay, we're going to try to get security and we'll come back, all right? And technically, we don't need to show you the contract because we're not hired by you. You guys have a lovely day. See you next time. Make sure you like and subscribe. Leave a comment. That's how you handle people, right? Thank you. Thank you. Hey, how's it going? Everything went well? Oh, yeah.
How's it going? How's it going, Ben? How are you? How are you? Just a couple of residents that were just concerned about this. Yeah, she can't be doing that, you know, interfering with what we're doing and stuff. And we just we were super respectful and super nice and just let her know what was going on. Okay, cool. Thank you very much. Thank you. Appreciate All right, bro. All right, man. We just talked to the security. We unfortunately we're not allowed to film them, but you guys heard the audio. But we ninja. I mean, we told her everything that we told her. Everything that she didn't know. What'd you tell her, Ninja? I, I told her that she needs to go on FWC.com, and they have literally everything that you need to know, from using air rifles, from traps, to what license you need to do that. Everything is on there. Yep. But people choose to be ignorant. How did, how did the interview go with the security? Oh, it went fine. They, 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 we've had trouble with this with this person before, and she's been scolded. She comes out and she dumps. This is not the first time. The first time yeah. she's come out with, with boxes of lettuce or boxes of cat food. You can't do that when there's invasive species in the area. Just because you've got feral cats in the area, don't think that you can yeah, come out and throw food. You can't do yeah, it. Yeah, encouraging that type of behavior is just going to encourage them to eat more, breed more, and to make the problem even worse. That's right, because these, these iguanas nowadays, they're just not eating vegetables, folks. They're eating, they've evolved to eat, where they're eating cat food, they're eating fish. I've even seen them eating uh, larvae from honey, uh, honey beehives. Uh, you know, they're eating meat, guys. Let's face it. They're all changing, you know? Oh, yeah. So it, they're not supposed They've been told before they cannot feed the cats. They cannot throw lettuce out there because they were doing that as well. So Exactly. So I'm glad we stood up to them. We told them what we needed to uh, tell them. Hopefully they'll go back, they'll do their research, and then they'll be able to educate themselves. Well, security knows that we're here. We, we inform them every time that we're here um you know and they know exactly what we do we're very friendly with the security here we're very friendly with the staff here they like they like uh, they like what what i'm doing here um yeah i need help i need help that's why i i, I put together the iguana people so we can we can all have help and we can rid this problem so if it wasn't for these two guys okay i'd have been sitting home depressed all my life i was sitting home for 10 years folks 10 years until i watched these two guys they kicked me out of the bed and here i am today here i am today you can be there too you can be there too just look below and see what you know and tell us and you can be there and we can dance just like the ninja <laughs> Guys, we're gonna get the final count up to up to par. Let you guys know what we got. Drop some comments and let me know how you think we handled the situation. Uh, who do you think was right in the situation? And um, yeah, just let us know what you guys think. I mean, I, I honestly think that they if they if they had a problem with what we were doing, they could have came up to us uh, a way better way instead of all aggressive storming up and la 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 la. Actually, walked a quarter of a mile down the road to start their crap. crap. And that's all it is. Is what I'll eat crap crap. Oh God! Oh crap! They don't—they don't understand the motto of the iguana people. What we're doing is we're taking out the invasive species, but we're also eating and utilizing these animals for food. So it's a win-win for the state, and it's a win-win for our stomachs. So if, if they can't get that, I mean, you know, it's—it's—it's—we can't. You're gonna cook a yadman style, man. <laughs> yadman. <laughs> we can't make everybody understand us, guys, but we know what we're doing. And we're, we are, we do have good intentions in our heart taking these invasive creatures out and of course utilizing the meat for food. Look how many, look, on a cold day. A cold day. Cold day. day. Get this, get this, this, just, this just shows you how, you know, how crazy it is out here. And yeah, we're trying to control whatever we can. It's the breeding season. What don't these people understand? I don't know. They don't get it, guys. Ready, Johan? They just don't get it. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. All right, Joe. Hey, that's going to wrap it up right there. Huge shout out to the Iguana people. Doing a huge effort, our boy uh, Brian and April from AMB, yeah. Reptile Removal, out there in Okeechobee. Guys, thank you guys so much for coming out here oh, and giving it a good, good effort. I'm really sorry you guys had to deal with that uh, person that, you know, was giving us issues. And what we're doing, it's not a pretty job. No, it is dirty. Not. Somebody's got to do it. It's not easy, but we are out here. We are committed yeah. as the iguana people to do it. So right. I really appreciate it. And what she was doing was illegal too. 
Right, exactly. So, you know, we were, you did fine. You were totally in the right. What she was doing was totally illegal. Johan, thoughts? I'll tell you, I'll tell you, man. I, I, re I really appreciated uh, Miss Groovy here <laughs> taking a stand. Unfortunately, I'm sorry to you fans that you had to see such, such hatred out there. Um, we, try, we try to avoid people like that. You know, we try to educate them. But unfortunately, they don't like they don't like to hear what's going on. So, uh -oh. he is. Look at Orangey. Look at Orangey sitting in the tree right there, like good four or five footer. Oh, I see him. <laughs> oh my God. So, anyway, so like I was saying, guys, we you know we're real sorry. We're real happy that you know we're getting all of the new fans. And again, look for the new channel. Uh, Raj, is that going to be up this weekend? Yep, it's going to be okay. up this weekend. The new page is born officially today. Iguana people will be up. Don't forget to hit all of our other brothers. Yep. Don't forget to hit the Iguana Man. Don't forget to hit the Iguana Ninja. And then, you know, continue hey. to hit, hit Sunset Aquatics because that's where it all started. Hey, the man. Iguana People Man is like a huge, like it's it's a big uh, team that we have of people that are committed to doing the same thing that we all love doing, which is controlling the invasive green iguana populations. If you want to join, that's the it. Iguana People, come out here. Hit us up. Yeah, let us hit know. us down below, man. Johan from Sunset Aquatics. You want to man, CJ. Let us know, y'all. Let us know. Thanks a lot, yo. And he got him. He got him. He got him. One shot, baby. Way to end the night. Where is he? I got him. All right, everybody's gone. I'm going to give you guys my little piece on this. I believe that lady, I believe she was out of line to be coming at us like that. We try really hard to be respectful, let her know what the deal is, what we're doing. She doesn't believe that we have a contract out here. First of all, where we're at, nobody's here right now. Second of all, we did talk, to, every time we come here, we talk to the security, we let the local law enforcement know what we're doing. Trust me, I it's it's a Sunday right now, I would rather much be at home right now than be out doing iguana removal, to be honest with you. I'm not complaining though, but she's just off her rocker. Secondly, I told her that yeah, we, we do take out the invasive green iguanas, they are invasive species. If you're unaware of that, go online and you can kind of educate yourself a little bit on the current iguana situation here in Florida. This is not something made up. This is facts. There's a lot of articles and a lot of things that she can read, educate herself a little bit. And uh, lastly, I told her all the iguanas that are harvested, all the big ones, they don't go to waste. People do eat them, okay? So we're thinking it's a win-win for the state. We take it out and we get to eat it. She's telling us a bunch of stuff, first of all, She's, by her saying that, is disrespecting my culture, disrespecting uh, the hunting heritage, disrespecting everything that we stand for, and she's she's supporting the uh, the breeding, procreation of invasive green iguanas, which you know they are they are pretty much established here. But that's not the point. Our point is is we've been hired out here to control them, control their populations. The population is crazy. It's the breeding season, so. She is completely unaware. And as you guys can see, we got over 50 iguanas on a cold day. This goes to show how thick the numbers are right there. Ninja just grabbed another one too right there as well. So you guys can see it right there. I mean, like I said, so let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Like, comment, hit that red subscribe button. See you guys on the next video. Peace. Peace.